Hi everyone, so welcome to my channel. My name is Tati. So today I'm going to be showing you a good, tasty recipe, traditional, especially in Puerto Rico. So today I'm going to be doing uh, mofongo, plantain, uh, pilon, garlic salt. So, but I'm going to show you uh, and show you all the steps. Okay, so right now uh, I'm gonna start with the shrimp. What I'm gonna do with the shrimp is uh, salsa mofongo, and you pour the shrimp with salsa, very juicy, so they can mix it very good and nice and tasty. Tasty, and well, let's get started. So I have a bag of shrimp. Uh, you can use one, two bag, as many as you want. So I'm just gonna keep it right there in the bowl. They're frozen. So I'm just going to pour some water, rinse it, and take the tail out. So I got my shrimp. I, I rinsed them. And I took the tail off. And I, I put a little bit of adobo to seasoning, just a little bit of sazon. Um, and I add um, basil leaves. So I stir them, season it. Good to go. So right here, I pour um, three tablespoons, three tablespoons of oil, and I add pepper. Let me show you here. You see? All right. Okay. So I'm just waiting for a couple minutes. So it gets um, heat up, and the flavor start mixing. So. So it's been like maybe two minutes. Yeah, like two minutes. I'm gonna add some pimientos. Pimientos, red pepper. I'm gonna pour everything. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay. Stay. I'm gonna add um, some garlic, just a little bit of garlic. Mm -hmm. Just that's it, it's enough. Okay. It starts smelling good, awesome. I, I love the smell. Let me show you how it looks like. It's been five minutes, so I'm gonna add one envelope of sazon and I'm gonna add the shrimp. Gonna mix them well. It's been a couple minutes. Look at that. I love it. I love the smell, I'm telling you. Since I put the pimientos, the red peppers. It's called pimientos morones. That's what it's called. Okay. Let's take a look. Beautiful. Okay. Um, remember when you when you do a uh, shrimp to add a little bit more extra because when you start cooking uh they shrink so how you can see over here it was full and then now look at that <laughs> so just uh take that in mind take that in mind okay keep that in mind i'm sorry keep that in mind um i'm gonna add tomato sauce 
It is finished. I'm just gonna add more for two minutes. Um, but I'm watching as I go. I'm just gonna pour some in here because I want more salsa, like liquid. Perfect. Just a little bit. Stir it. Hey, I don't want the salsa to be like the liquid to be very thick. So I want it like watery okay I like it I love it I'm gonna add some more so I pour half of tomato sauce can of chicken broth because remember I want a uh, liquid I love it so if you want liquid just add more salsa and chicken broth if you add more salsa uh, tomato sauce that's what I mean um, the more you put uh, it's gonna be thicker so that's why I add the chicken broth so it doesn't look thicker you see you didn't liquid it like soapy that's the way that I want it okay but you can adjust it the way that you like it I'm just thinking if I should add more because I want the liquid that's why I, mean. right, I think that's good I'm just gonna leave it like that uh, I'm gonna put the lid okay and to let it it's already cooked. I just want all the flavor mixed together. 